So I was just about to go past like this, and then I saw that right there. I sold these Adidas uh, Commando shoes. Cool looking Adidas shoe. Almost have a bottom of like a Yeezy. A little bit different texture, but. Nike uh, Roche or Roche runs for $35 plus shipping. Cool little Nike insulated, uh, kind of a running shoe, hiking boot. Got these at the bins, only paid uh, a couple bucks for them. Sold them for $35 plus shipping. Sold these Samuel Hubbard Chucka boots. I actually just featured these on my last video I did about top 10 shoes to sell on eBay. Great shoes to sell. These are, uh, these average over $100 for pre-owned, the Chucka boots and some of the other boots from Samuel Hubbard. So if you guys find these out and about, I paid $8 for these, but if you find them out and about, definitely pick them up because lots of profit here to be had. So paid $8 for these, sold them for $88.50 plus shipping. Sold some more of these Uppa Baby adapters. This is a bigger one. I think these are for the Chico. Yeah. Chico. Um, I bought a lot of these, a lot of 15 or 16. I paid $80 total for all of those items. So what's that make, like five or six dollars into each piece. And I'm selling them on average uh, 28 or $29. So this one sold for $34.99, I believe. I'll put the uh, card up here plus shipping. And uh, it's turned out to be a fairly decent deal. I think after all is said and done, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll profit around $300 total, I believe, after expenses and everything I took in So not a ton of money for um, 15 items, but you know, it's a def decent amount to make profit, and they're selling pretty quick, so I'm happy about that. I sold this unicorn. I uh, have pennies into this. This is a Creatology unicorn. Um, I think I had it listed for like 13. I took an offer for 11.50 plus shipping. Cool little toy. Maybe a quarter, if not less, in this. Sold a pair of Kohan dress shoes. These Oxfords right here. Size 13. I, I can't remember if I got these at the bins or the uh, regular Goodwill, but. Uh, at my goodwill, these would probably be eight dollars. So let's just say eight dollars. Then I sold them for forty dollars plus shipping. So not a bad little profit on those. Kohan Oxford size 13. Forty dollars plus shipping. I sold this uh, Marmot women's jacket. A little bit better light here. So Marmot woman's uh, ski jacket. Faux fur lined. I got this at the bins a long, long time ago. Probably only have three, three, four dollars into it. Sold it for thirty dollars plus shipping. Another really good item I uh, I just sold was a Bront Tweeds blanket. I have a few of these in different colors. There's kind of a bluish green, and then there's this brown and orange and then this is the one I sold of course it's the one on the bottom so let me uh, pull these off real quick this is a really really good brand to look out for I don't know if you guys have ever seen this brand um, a blanket or not it's a UK brand called Bronte tweeds or Bront tweeds so I just wanted to showcase this uh, blanket a little better here in the light so Bronte tweeds or Bront tweeds 
Um, this is a, a vintage blanket, all wool, made in the UK. Really, really, really nice quality. So five or six dollars into this, and I got uh, eighty-eight dollars plus shipping. Bronte Tweeds, definitely uh, look out for that brand. Another sale I had are these Olokai Poco shoes. Um, I actually got these in a retail arbitrage uh, trip to Nordstrom Rack. Um, I got those Borns and some Columbias and these Olukais. Paid $9 for them and ended up selling them for $94 plus shipping. Really cool little Olukai, brand new retail arbitrage at Nordstrom Rack. If you guys aren't checking out clearance at Nordstrom Rack, go check it out because they got some really good stuff there. So I was just about to go past and then I saw that right there. Yep. Looks like it's not a big size, but it looks authentic. Never seen that colorway before. Kind of cool. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. Happy holidays.